مرحبا hello uh, today i'm going to continue the uh, about uh, renting an apartment because i uh, i talked about like a couple of questions uh, last time and uh, i'm going to add uh, on the last video i had to wait uh, today uh, because uh, the sun was getting on the board, so I had to sit and wait until uh, the sun set, uh, or sun down, excuse me. Um, so, um, before going to continue with the, with the, the video, uh, I'm going to uh, bring to your attention uh, some um, issues that uh, some people can uh, um, encounter when they uh, they uh, find themselves in uh, Middle East. Uh, I have had a couple of students uh, who uh, they had some like issues with the the landlord or the owner of the apartment. Uh, like here, of course, when you are learning a language. Uh, I want to uh, add to to it like the uh, custom or um, the customs uh, or the uh, cultures aspect uh, the cultures uh, aspect uh, uh, of the Arab culture of it like the, the talking about the Arab culture. So let's say um, you are coming from a Western uh, country and you are renting this apartment uh, or you live and you um, you know your friend from uh, the United States or from a Western country uh, they tell you that hey uh, we are going to uh, um, visit you uh, pay you a visit or so uh, I know um, you live there and you maybe you might even think uh, uh, about uh, what to tell them and how you handle the situation. I can, let's give you an example of one of my students. He lived in Jordan uh, and he was renting this apartment. So his uh, friend, uh, I think his girlfriend, yes, his girlfriend, she called him and she said, okay, I want to see you. And he said, yes, well, I'm so excited. And when she, <clears throat> when she came, uh, he went he, and picked her up from the airport and uh, he took her say, to the apartment. So uh, the owner of the apartment said, hey, what's going on? And you are, uh, who is this? And he said, this is my girlfriend. He said, what, a girlfriend? No, 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 this is not, I can't let you do that. He said, okay, uh, why? Should I kick uh, my friend out from my uh, apartment? He said, uh, I rented the apartment to you, not just, uh, you, can, you can't use it. In, the, in uh, Arab countries or Middle East, uh, there are rules uh, to follow. So if you are a Westerner and living in the uh, Middle East, uh, so don't think uh, about your, your, uh, your culture, your American or Western uh, culture. So think because you are uh, there for your safety, for uh, for uh, for res to show respect and uh, if you have a friend who is uh, uh, paying your visit or uh, uh, coming to see you, uh, you need to uh, ask the, the 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 landlord or the the owner of the apartment. He say, hey, uh, uh, is it possible for me to uh, receive or to have uh, my friend staying uh, with me in this apartment? And uh, they're gonna say, oh no or you have to be married that you have or some people they say no no they need to stay uh, at a hotel and uh, you are staying here and other uh, student also um, told me that uh, the, the the owner of the apartment told him that I'm going to pay to charge you extra for everybody everyone who is staying with you so he found this like ridiculous what how come like uh, uh, I have the right to receive uh, my guest and he said no uh, you are the only one who is allowed in this uh, country in this apartment so you so I want you to be aware I want you to take into consideration the 
the differences, uh, the customs, and uh, how to handle. Like I don't want to, uh, like mm, some some people like who is renting, uh, or so, who are renting apartment there or place, and they can feel like I say free, and they can drink or can have hang out with a friend, and uh, we need to uh, show uh, the best. Uh, 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 and uh, show your uh, respect uh, to uh, the people who you live with and uh, it's a question of reputation, that's how they see it. Uh, today um, I am going to continue and uh, see uh, like it's a dialogue uh, between you and uh, the landlord or you and the owner of the, the apartment and of course last time I just uh, uh, did some question I am today I'm going to add the the answer it's like a dialogue that you can uh, uh, see so uh, I didn't want to uh, have like a long video so I wrote everything on the board and you can take a, a look pause and uh, just practice uh, these uh, uh, the, the conversation okay so um, I invite you to see and I am going to step uh, back so you can see I'm not on your uh, in your way okay so <clears throat> So here, the uh, you are the rent, uh, the, the one who rents. Uh, his renting is al mustajer, al musta, al mustajer, mustajer. Like there is a pause, and the number two is sahib al bait, sahib al bait, and he is the owner, sahib al bait, the owner or the landlord, owner. Or the person he in charge. Okay, and uh, you are going to continue your question by asking one of my students. He said you did not include the uh, the bathroom, and I found that's very uh, important uh, question to ask about because uh, some people maybe they find themselves in uh, sharing the the. The, uh, the restroom or the bathroom with other uh, people, okay? So the question is, is there uh, a bathroom? The question is, هل هناك حمام? هل هناك حمام? I am, I'm writing this, هل هناك حمام? You go, and he say, هل هناك حمام? And you are going, he's going to say, yes, there is a bathroom. نعم في حمام. نعم في Hammam, Nam fi Hammam. And you need also to ask about the water because sometime um, you find yourself in a place the water comes on uh, just at eight or ten PM every other day or uh, twice a week or three times a week and you can find uh, other uh, apartment where they have the water running like of the, the whole time and there is no they don't cut the, the water off. So, والماء, and that is another way to say الماء is maya. So, everybody, uh, like in the Arab world, they say maya. Uh, when they say, do you want maya? Maya means uh, water. والمaya, والماء, maya. What about the water? And uh, the answer, في ميا كل يوم. There is water every day. في ميا كل يوم. Fi maya kulio. So there is a water every day. The next one is there a heater? Last time we talked about uh, the uh, the AC unit. Now, when you, if you are traveling and you are staying in a cold weather, you need to know how to say uh, uh, the heater. So hel hunek musachin musachin. Or sakhan, sakhan or musakhin, sakhan or musakhin, and they are going to ask. Naam, hunak musakhin fi shaka. Naam, hunak musakhin fi ashaka. Yes, there is a heater in the apartment, and um, there is a heater that heats the water, and the heater that heats the apartment, like. So you want to make sure. Musakhin al-maya and musakhin al-shaka. 
So you have to be uh, very specific, like uh, what if uh, you have to heat the water on the stove and then take it to the, the, to the uh, uh, bathroom to take a shower. You have to make sure that there is a musakhin for al maya there is a for the maya and there is musakhin or sakhan li al shaka for the whole apartment uh, and and they say naam hunak musakhin fi shaka yes there is a heater in the apartment now one thing is the wi-fi you are asking is there wi-fi hal hunak wi-fi hal hunak wi-fi and say no, there is no Wi-Fi. There is no, there is no Wi-Fi. La mafi Wi-Fi. La mafi Wi-Fi. Okay, so no, there is no Wi-Fi again. Is there? Is there Wi-Fi? Is there Wi-Fi? And you, and they are saying no, there is no Wi-Fi. No, there is no Wi-Fi. La mafi Wi-Fi. So, when you go to ask about Wi-Fi, there is always, uh, they're gonna tell you, okay, there is no Wi-Fi fi shaka. There is mafi Wi-Fi in, sh in, the apart in the apartment, but you can get by um, uh, like a SIM card and uh, they can show you where to buy the SIM card and you can have uh, a, a Wi-Fi uh, uh, and you can use your laptop or, or and they can guide you if you want a, a Wi-Fi for your phone or SIM card or something uh, that you can use uh, for your computer. So um, that's it uh, for uh, today and uh, see you next time. Uh, with uh, another topic so uh, I would greatly appreciate your feedback it just if you want to see you have question that maybe uh, you have you are wondering how what to say to ask and how is it appropriate to say to ask this are you offending someone or not so you make sure that you include them uh, in your comments and say uh, Abbasia, we want to see this topic uh, because uh, your comment is going to motivate me to add more uh, videos. But if you just watch and just, uh, yeah, that's, I'd say maybe they didn't like it. Maybe uh, they, I want you to show, like to react or to f reflect on my video. Plus you can share any, um, any, uh, you, you know, uh, a conflict or uh, an event or something happened, incident that happened to you in the past, maybe you can, uh, it's going to be avoided if you can share it with other uh, people uh, uh, on, uh, on the comment section. Uh, again, shukran wa ma'a as